and they're off. 17.50 ahead of them in the Al Nanamar Cup and they got away to quite a level break and not a great deal of pace on here with Najar right out in front towards the inside and quite keen Nora Al Hardy and between those two is Osela then around the outside is Mastora as they now make their run towards the back straight pulling very hard Manakel now racing up horses into third position at the moment the back marker is lawyer who's running a little greenly at the back of the field together with haraku as they make their way down the back straight and mastora hasn't had to work that hard at all to go clear and cross the inside rail and there's no tempo on it here with Najaa racing just in second on that one's outside manikel is in third osela is covered up in fourth position towards the outside ajs najma with 800 to go they're going towards the turn harab al nate is next to the field with around the outside zakia and the one there who almost clipped heels was last year's winner roma switched on the wide outside and had to be taken right back there by rider Asheen Murphy. Now the reigning champion is last of the 14. They're making the turn, 600 to go, still no injection of pace. Mastor has had the run of the race, leads by three parts to a length to the outside. Manakel in second, AJS Najma making ground but he's three deep. Pushed along on the inside, Najaar alongside Osela as they make the turn in. Staying on is Zakia as they now race on down the home straight. Lawyer picking up from a long, long way back. It is still Mastora who has the lead over Osela in second. Staying on Talgat Al Shahania down the outside. Cab Gazal is picking up. Zakia may have a say in things. It's O'Sailor who takes the lead now for Christoph Suvion, and it is O'Sailor who wins. In second came Talgat Al Shahania. On the inside, Mastora in third, tight four. Gab Gazal on the outside of Aziza, who was never nearer. Here is the full result of race four, the local purebred Arabian Philian mare Al Nama Cup, run over 1,750 metres. First, number 10, O Sailor, ridden by Christophe Sumion. Second, number 12, Talgat Al Shahania. Third, number 7, Mastora. Fourth, number 4, Cab Gazal. And the fifth horse was number one, Aziza. 10, 12, 7, and 4 were the numbers. The runtime, 1 minute 59.59 seconds. 1 minute 59.59 seconds. Race 4 is now official. Yeah, good performance from horse and rider as well to get this mare into the, the right position to attack. Uh, she was always in a good spot there, just got a little tight and she got that inside rail. We saw this a lot on the dirt yesterday, being in a forward position and then being able to angle out on the bend and get a clear run up the straight worked very well and it's worked well again here. Christophe Sumiel just in behind the leaders there, tracking the pace and the question was, did she have the, the turn of foot to go and put the race to bed and that's exactly what she did. And that's another purebred Arabian race, gone to Al Shakab Racing and to Jean de Mule and Christophe Sumion. These are the closing stages, but it, it was pretty comfortable and, and all wrapped up, I, I think, at this stage. Targat al Shahani has uh, run well and, and stayed in good form, but ultimately just couldn't match the, the finishing kick of Osela, who comes out on top. We'll do the presentation very shortly.
A start of uh, more success to come, you would imagine, this weekend for Al Shakab Racing. We'll meet their representative soon, collecting the winning prize from our presenter, who has already taken to the stage for this local purebred Arabian filly and mare Al Nama Cup. And we'll be making the presentation any moment. Now, there we are. That's Hamza Al Sayari, the owner of We Make Events Company. Hamza, thank you ever so much for presenting these three awards. First of all, to the winning rider, please welcome Christophe Sumion. Well done to Christophe, two today, and that's a fourth success out here in Qatar this year. Christophe Sumion, the winning rider. Good applause there from everyone around, including Thomas Forsey. An excellent clap there from you. That's a very powerful clap. Jean de Mule is going to go and collect his award as well. And we can give him a big round of applause. And Thomas Forsey alongside him as well. Well done to Jean. A double on the day. And to Al Shakab, well done to them. Another double collecting the prize. Please welcome Sheikh Ahmed bin Juan Al Thani. <laughs> Congratulations to Al Shakab Racing. Our thanks to Hamza Al Sayari, the owner of We Make Events, for presenting these awards. There's the photo. Uh, winner of race number four, ladies and gentlemen, Osela.